so I'm away from my stuff for the weekend, so I don't really have a wacky intro plan, and I apologize for the audio quality, uh, but yeah, pinch time, yeah. Congratulations, Andy, it's your 200th video you've edited. Holy crap, why are you still here? Are you okay? Do you need anything? Drink, coffee, waffle. Indie horror games are either like, you're on a submarine because you were sent to explore a mysterious pit in the ocean floor and you slowly realize you weren't meant to surface. Or, <laughs> Mr. Scrubkiss is gonna get you, don't let him get you! And Mr. Scrubkiss is the one everyone talks about. Yeah. Go touch grass. Me with potted plants inside my house. Do not interact unless you answer my riddles three. Riddle one, what is your name? Riddle two, what is your quest? Riddle three, what has 13 hearts and no other organs? Texas confession. I've never seen snow IRL. I posted this and it snowed like two inches a week later for the first time in like 35 years. Texas confessions. I've never had a million dollars. Hey, uh, Tomboy? Is this Attack on Titan? I mean, yeah. Yeah, it seems right. Listen, in this household, respect your ancestors. They all lived and died for you. Tumblr shouldn't have given me the ability to talk in big text. Giant trumpet. Do you ever decide to gaslight a woman so badly that she becomes a plan just to get away from you? Is that what happened in Kirby Triple Deluxe? Peeling those sour rainbow gummy strips into long thin strings and putting them into cheap energy drink to create something I'm calling Battery Acid Spaghetti. We'll update once I've finished it. Don't... don't do this. Hey, don't tell me what to do! Don't do this. Whenever I see post-apocalyptic films set in the USA where everyone is pretty much just killing each other with no mention of other nations, I always just assume that the rest of the world is fine and has learned how to resume life as normal. Should we do something about the Americans? Nah. What do you mean I don't know how to flirt? I literally tell you random and unimportant fun facts. Why aren't you wooed? I am such a water drinker, like literally, um, gulp, gulp. I don't believe you. Writing prompt. God said to Noah, Gather two of every animal so they may survive the flood. Even the Pokemon? Even the Pokemon. It's so hard being a silly goose in this anti whimsy society. You barely even have room to frolic nowadays. Ugh. Hey, if Tom the dies, here's a list of places you can find me. The woods at 3.48 a.m. People new to Tumblr are angry about being blocked or writing huge paragraphs about why they chose to block someone like, I promise you, it's not that deep. I once blocked someone because their block was obnoxiously orange and I hate the color orange. Hey, LP, after I reblog this, I'm blocking you because I fucking love orange. Fuck you. Every time I see a bunch of posts from Neil Gaiman on my feed, I'm like, Neil, you're procrastinating writing again, aren't you? Neil? Vampire doctors that can smell if you have a blood disease. Werewolf therapy animals for sick kids. Nature sprite and nymph nurses that always make sure people have pretty flowers to brighten up their white rooms. Fawns that go around and sing and dance for patients so that they smile. Nice monster hospitals would be amazing. Succubus nurses that give you the sook before you die. <sighs> Thanks, Tumblr users, Galoigi. Hey, would Magneto be able to lift Mjolnir? That's a... Huh. Hey, uh, if someone without a gender experiences romantic or sexual attraction, does that make them the gay agenda? This is my beautiful son. His name is... Steam Steam Apps Common. Wow. Music is weird. Humanity found out how to hit the air in the right way, and now we argue which is better. It's all the same in the end. Stop arguing. That is... Ooh. <laughs> That's a hot take. Bro, you just triggered my dynamic display, bro. I'm flaring my wings and bobbing my head while hissing at you, bro. B -b Please be scared of me. <coughs> Please, for the love of God, stop saying that I, an autistic person, remind you of Sheldon Cooper. This is not the compliment that you think it is. And no, I will not say Bamungus. Nowadays, so many Tumblr posts are just about Tumblr. We're running into things to talk about. 
I switched my trash can with my neighbors today because theirs is nicer. You! Now that's a deep dive Tumblr joke right there. Good luck finding it. This character is not canonically bisexual. Yeah, to you. I know them personally. It's called parasocializing, Sharon. Past me is an idiot and future me is a bastard. I only exist in the present. <laughs> like, is this like that part in Homestuck where Car Cat argues with himself through paradox time? Hey, how many fingers do you have? Ten? How many do you intend to keep? Uh, Mario only saves Peach to get a kiss on the cheek. Wrong! Mario saves Peach because she's his friend and he loves her and also because he's a good person who wants to help others. The cheek kiss is merely a nice bonus. Also, have you ever had a cheek kiss? It's pretty great. Bowser, are you homophobic? You think I'm scared of gay people? I'm Bowser! Technology is amazing. I haven't been able to get the full video, but we just celebrated one of our steam locomotives turning 145 by checking a chocolate cake into our firebox. Can you just imagine making a whole chocolate cake only to throw it into the firebox? But also, happy birthday, I guess. Aw, isn't it cute? Picture of the wettest, most pathetic looking guy you've ever seen. Ah, uh, the bucky spoon, scringly do, the shrunkle scrimblo. Important note to all Dracula fans. Coca-Cola was invented in 1886, and the story is set in 1897. This means you can authentically hint a Coca-Cola in any and all fan work set around the book's time period. Not that it's very impressive, since Dracula himself wouldn't drink it, but certainly the American suitor can. Van Helsing absolutely wired on classic cocaine Coca-Cola defeating Dracula. I need this in my life. Okay, correct me if I'm wrong. But did you know that carrying a sword is generally illegal? And they are considered firearms? They're considered the same as guns? What? My mom keeps asking me shit like, Have you drank anything today? And do you need to take a break? And how damn long is it going to take you for you to finish your math? Like what math you mean? <laughs> what math? Jeff Kinney announces new series, Diary of an Even Wimpier Kid. When asked for details, he replies, You thought that poor son of a bitch was wimpy. <laughs> you haven't seen shit yet, brother. In a shocking move of one-upsmanship, Lincoln Pierce, author of the Big Nate series, has countered Kinney's announcement with his own. My new series is called Bigger Nate, Pierce said, and he's, he's huge now. Just the, just the biggest motherfucker you've ever seen. Tumblr is my bedroom this, and Tumblr is a pinboard that. Tumblr is an apartment complex with thin walls, and every so often you just have to listen to your neighbor say the most deranged shit imaginable. We all vacuum at the same time. Um, hey, sorry if this is stupid, but the Earth has, like, mountains and valleys and stuff, you know? So I don't see how it can be flat. If there's mountains and stuff, sorry if it's stupid, I'm sorry. My Nana thinks the Earth is cube and mountains are just the corners. T -t Tell your Nana to text me. Doctor, I'm sorry, but we had to remove your colon. Me, why? Wait. Zoom in. Jeff, you son of a bitch. Neither alive nor dead, but a secret third thing. At sea. If you aren't at least vaguely aware of your friend's digestive system issues, are you even friends? Like, bro, do you know that your best friend has IBS? Do you? Normalize that getting a cutie mark in elementary school. Normalize grown stallions and men with that cutie mark. Normalize never getting your cutie mark. Hmm. Mad because you're a blank flank, aren't you? Shut your mouth! Making my humidifier and dehumidifier participate in a cruel and pointless war. <laughs> the title cloudy with a chance of meatball acronyms in an unusually pronounceable way. Quackum. It's not even a stretch. You could just say it like a normal word. You don't usually get that with titles that long. Why didn't Flynn name the machine that? That would have been clever. Hey, Frank, what's your special attack and what does it do? My special attack, uh, Wormageddon, does something to do with worms. I bet it's an apocalyptic rain of worms. God couldn't strike me down even if they tried. I've lived through my worst and I'm still here. In fact, I'm pretty sure God did try. I don't know when, but they did. That's how living out of spite works, folks. I'm sorry, are you renowned Jojo villain Dio Brando? Oh, what funky bad choices will I make today? Oh, nobody knows. Look out, world. Jane's coming.
So Elon Musk decided to ruin Twitter. Guys, you know what this means? The Twitter users are migrating to Tumblr, dear God! It was because of the stinky line picture, wasn't it? We did it, Andy. We destroyed Twitter. Weakness. A black cat rusting, tote coating a lighter brown shade in sunlight. <sighs> Just like Coca Cola. The funniest rich kid court defense is definitely, Yana, my client is a spoiled brat who can't function in the real world, so how can he possibly comprehend the consequences of crime? And it works. I'm pretty sure Velma tried to do that and flubbed the execution horribly. Men who have made having a big epic beard their whole personality are so fascinating. Same with the one who whacks their mustaches into that pointy handlebar style, so they look like a whimsical 1850s candy store owner. What's going on with you, bro? Hey, Rondo, don't ask about my business. Probably a bad RPG idea. Simplify the alignment system by having everything be either red or blue. My alignment is true purple. <sighs> Classic Tumblr response. PM, I'm curious to see if you'll put random Discord notification sounds in a video, just to see if people will fall for it. Sounds evil. I like it. Hey, uh, can you pick me up if I'm drunk? I don't have to anymore. I'm home now. Yes, I was aware of that after dropping you off at home. <laughs> this is too funny to me. One time I dreamt I went to a public bathroom and the person in the stall next to me stated my full name and address and started retelling my entire life story as I fearfully tried to shit faster. Good God. Sounds like a shitty way to get doxxed. We uh, are a society. Need to put more focus on robotic love interests who are quite literally just giant fucking computers. This girl is a big blocky machine takes up a whole room, not a single limb in sight. Everything she says is barely comprehensible because her voice sounds so weird. Yes, it does make her 50 times sexier. Who is Gladys? Not a chance in hell, pretty boy. Yeah, you saw the title. We're doing this. My wife threatened to leave me due to my obsession with the monkeys. I didn't think she was serious. And then I saw her face. What happens if you cross an angry cow with an angry sheep? You get two animals that are in a bad mood. Does no one say YOLO anymore? Or are they all dead? I asked my German friend, what's a three letter word for compete? My friend said, why? And I said, because I'm trying to finish a crossword. What do you call a fake Sudanese person? A Sudanese. I started a band with friends called 999 megabytes. Still haven't gotten a gig though. I went to a friend's house and he said, make yourself at home. So I threw him out. I hate having people over. I just read that someone in New York gets stabbed every 52 seconds. <sighs> Ooh, poor guy. I'm also in a band called the Palindromes. Our first single is called, If I Had a Hi-Fi. What do you call a pot of singing killer whales? An orcapella group? If pro is the opposite of con, then what's the opposite of progress? How many potatoes does it take to kill an Irishman? None. The waiter came to my table and asked, Do you want a box for your leftovers? So I knocked his ass out with a left hook. I once dated a girl with a twin. People used to ask me how I told them apart. Well, Lisa painted her fingernails red, and Bob had a... I met a girl at a bar when we went back to hers and started making out on the sofa. She gave me a cheeky look and said, I think we should take this upstairs. Okay, I said, you carry one end and I'll get the other. Be careful getting through the door frame and we'll come back down for the cushions. Freddie Mercury, Bruno Mars, and Venus Williams all walk into the same bar. But they didn't plan it. Did you know it's impossible to eat baklava underground? Because then it's bak magma. How can you tell the difference between a nerd and someone with a BDSM fetish? Ask them what a dungeon master is. How do you get 30 Canadians out of a pool? You say, okay everybody, it's time to get out of the pool. Whoever coined the term delivery for childbirth made a big mistake. It should have been called takeout instead. 3,027 years from today, life will either be really good or really bad. It's 50-50. You can't keep getting away with it! The most dangerous kind of canoes are Vulcanoes. I'm going to pronounce it like that now. Talking about your pet. Oh, they're my little guy, my fluffy, silly troublemaker. Talking to your pet. You're a threat to society. You're a menace and a terrorist and a war criminal. You're remorseless and silly, my funny little guy. These are my 16 kids. Pawn, 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 rook, Knight, Bishop, Queen, King, Bishop, Knight, and Rook. 
Ugh, just found out my neighbors named all her 16 kids after mine. Okay, everyone, line up. For whom the sneef snorfs? Does the sneef snore for you? I thought not. Get out of here. I miss them. Fictional character I think about literally every single day. Being in your 20s is about experiencing the worst thing you can imagine. And then having to go to the grocery store. Behold, the sheepdog puppy herds entire flock into owner's kitchen. That's a prodigy. You missed the best part. They weren't even their sheep. This good puppy gathered up a bunch of rain of sheep it found somewhere on the countryside and brought them home for its human. I love them. Fantasy authors are now banned from titling their books anything to do with crowns, thorns, precious metals, roses, blood or bones. You have to think of something else now. Hmm. Hats, prickles, tinfoil, dandelions, bile, and cartilage. I hate loopholes. My roommate's boyfriend is playing D&D online, FaceTime, I don't know, in the next room, and mostly he's quiet. But he just erupted out in a scratchy character voice. Where are my socks? Are they in your mouth? Spit them out right now! What kind of campaign is he playing? An average one. You know what? You are so right. Also, this is, this is the time for me to tell you, Andy. If we ever get to do another character for another campaign, I'm doing a goblin and you can't stop me. No offense. I mean, no offense, really. But I hate seeing these normal-ass people at the top of my page. Th these fucking normals. Normal weirdo freaks. Bucky, has anyone ever told you how right you are about everything ever? Yes, of course. Literally all the time. Whose job is it to shave a kiwi to make a hacky sack? Uh, <laughs> what did you just say? His big, doleful eyes and violently self-destructive tendencies have captivated me. Yes, baby girl. You are a very handsome young man. There needs to be a bad romance movie about someone falling in love with the Tumba Mutual. It's called The Feeling is Mutual. Soda Butch out here being funnier than me on my own post? I think everyone who enjoyed this post back in 2021 should know that I am now dating the person that inspired it. The Feeling was mutual. Uh... I have three moods. Skips every song on my iPod. Let's the music play without interruption. And plays the same song and repeat for days. What's an iPod? Been on Tumblr so long, my text post is outdated. <laughs> Fucking oof. 1910s guys who call including left-handed characters and stories FORCED DIVERSITY! Why are people who do cool things always so weird? I have a startling truth to keep from you. About the relationship between cool and weird. What is it with Tumblr users and biting? I bet you people have never bitten someone IRL. Get a load of the only child! Big nocturnals, some massive haunters, some humongous spunk donkillers! For fuck's sakes, I can't believe I had to do this myself. Big supernaturals! I'm gonna stop you right there. For fucker's sake! Boobs! Literally right there!